Good Saturday morning, everybody. What's up? It's Dave's morning commute to work. Yes, Dave works on Saturdays. Sorry I haven't made one of these in a while. Just been kind of, I guess, getting back into the swing of work after vacation. Vacations are awesome, but they're also hell at the same time because you have to get all caught up to everything. But um, nonetheless, it's cold. It's uh, ridiculously cold. It's, I don't like, 20. It might be colder than that. It's just ridiculously cold and this light sucks. Um, but anyway, what's been going on in this world? A bunch of crazy shit. Can't see my eyes. So, what should we talk about first? Okay, how about the uh, the Texas church shooter? Um, I don't know. There's just so many things wrong with this situation. Um, of course, you know, he was imprisoned for assault while in the Air Force, and the Air Force forgot to file the proper paperwork to prevent him from getting a gun. Then again, he lives in Texas, and I think if you're a felon in Texas, I think you can still have, like, 12 guns. I don't think you can have an arsenal. I just don't think you're limited, but you can still buy guns. Nonetheless, have you guys seen this dude? I mean, he looks... looked weird and disturbed. I mean, he... That should have been a, a dead giveaway at that point, but it's uh, horribly unfortunate, uh, you know, and horribly cowardly, too, you know. I mean, he went to church to, I guess, shoot his ex-girlfriend and her mother who weren't in church, so instead he decides to massacre everybody. Smart guy. Piece of work. Piece of work. Again, I just further emphasizes the fact that it's not a gun issue, it's a person issue, because... The system's there to pr protect people, and they didn't. So, horribly unfortunate. Um, uh, better background checks. What else can you do? My fucking sunglasses keep falling. But anyway, um, what else is new? Okay. All the uh, the sexual harassment allegations in, in you know, in showbiz. Um, oh, yeah, this is a horrible, horrible situation, and... It's just crazy how, like, many people are, like, coming out now. And what is it? One of the quarries. I think it was the, the dead one. I don't know. Feldman. Hame. One of them. I don't know. But one of them accused Charlie Sheen of molesting him when he was, like, 14. It's like, Charlie Sheen was a male whore. Um, I don't think he's going to molest a 13-year-old boy when he's, like, 20. You know I mean? I, I just don't see that to be the point. But... Also, Louis C.K., I mean, that guy looks creepy as it is, and he actually came out and admitted it, that he abused his power. I didn't know he had any power. But it's horribly unfortunate, and uh, people are just, I don't know, taking advantage of their situation, it's, it's bad. It just goes to show that this world is full of horrible, horrible people, and only you can be a better person. But, um, yeah, this is a 3 minute 23 second video so far. Uh, my arm's getting tired. I need that I'm having a stroke. Um, but, yeah, it's cold. Hope everybody else is doing well. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button. Share me. Use me. Whatever you want to do. Um, but, yeah, any comments or concerns or insights or whatever. Oh, yeah, and the, uh, the Miami Dolphins still suck, unfortunately. Um, Jay Cutler had a good game, but we traded away Jay Ajayi for a washing machine, I think. He used washing machine to the Philadelphia Eagles. Smart move. But yeah, we're playing the Carolina Panthers Monday, and uh, everybody's picking us to uh, to lose, and it's probably going to happen because they're the number one defense, so not going to be good. But hey, um, I'll talk to Yin's guys later.